I'm a fire and my laser engraver. We pride ourselves here at Tinkernut for preparing the masses for the upcoming zombie apocalypse. Can I use this laser to get rid of my girlfriend that I printed out? Kevin, you know what, never mind. Yeah, you can do that. On the stepper motor, how did you find out where the four solder points went to on the Arduino stepper adapter? Most optical drive stepper motors have four ports that you can solder wires to. Two are the plus and minus for the A side, and the other two are the plus and minus for the B side. Now the easy stepper motor driver is laid out like this with ports for the A plus and minus and the B plus and minus, and those should match up accordingly where you don't have to cross any wires. Will this work on metal, wood, and plastic too? I think that depends on the strength of your laser and the speed of your laser. I could totally make a program to do all those calculations for me instead of going through that long text editing process. If I had more time, I'd make one too. But if you or anyone else wants to beat me to it, I would love to see it and I'll make sure you get the proper credit for it. First a pencil, later 3D printer, then laser cutter. What next? Maybe a machine gun? I was thinking of something a little bit more user friendly. Maybe like some type of robot that pats you on the back and then shoots you with the machine gun. Can you make a PCB milling machine next with the CNC machine? That sounds like a great idea, and I think it's going to be the one that I'll go with for next week's video, assuming that I can get it working. All right, everyone, thanks very much for all the comments, and if you'd like to support my show, please go to tinkernut.com donate. And for more videos like this, please visit tinkernut.com. See you guys next week.